Well, we have one, two, three, four, and the fifth one that is being uh, just created now. Uh, so five studios here. Here we install activity uh, with vinyl for the comfort for the dancer, and, uh, and the sperm floor is the best for the dancer. I think you can like push more on a spring floor because you know that there's support underneath you. When I came in 2009, I, I, I did say what I thought it was necessary for the school. At the time, we had only two studios. Uh, and then I said, you know, if you want to make a, a, you know, a school uh, at the standard of today, of course, different than 1975, uh, we need to have more studios. So thanks to the collaboration with the Ballet de Monte Carlo at the time, uh, Jean-Christophe Maillot gave us the possibility to work there, which is, we still do in the morning with our studios. Um, but then little by little, we had to build ourselves uh, studios here. And uh, so it's a, it's a big project that has been taught since 2010, 11. And finally, after the coronavirus lockdown, when everything came to back to normal, uh, the, the Franz Albert uh, decided that it, it was possible to create the studio. So, you know, it's, let's say that's the end probably of the project I had as a, as a new director coming here. Uh, so it's the end of a big chapter for me, this construction, and it shows that uh, how, how happy also the, the, the country is about the name of the school today and the help they're giving us to create such a, such a big studio, such an amazing studio in a country like Monte Carlo. Now, I have not had any problem with our camp. I see that they are very curious to put themselves always in the first position. Uh, I know that there is a lot of business behind, the, uh, behind the, the ballet floor. There are a lot of other great brands that they do that. But I'm very, uh, like I said before, I'm faithful to the people with whom I have worked, but not blind. Faithful, but not blind, meaning uh, that we are always constantly looking at the product, understanding, getting a, a also feedback from our weekend if they find new things. Uh, you know, when we had to build the studio now, uh, talking with the people that have uh, advised me as well, uh, we realized that this floor was the best for what we were working for and what we were using. I think the opportunities and experiences we get and this so many teachers that want to help us. So we get a lot of time with everyone and that's really important. I think you can like push more on a spring floor because you know that there's support underneath you and your bones are going to stay strong. Whereas with a hard floor, you always have that thing in the back of your head. What if it, I don't land well? Of course, from, from the moment where you buy something, it is a big investment. Uh, but when you, see, uh, when you see the quality of the work you can do, at the end, it's not such a big uh, uh, financial investment because I think it's vital. And yeah, it's, it's, uh, before they should start teaching, they should have the right tools.